The firing range of Russia's latest BAL coastal defense missile system has doubled after the trials of its new missile that is capable of striking ground targets in addition to warships, a source in the domestic defense industry told TASS on Tuesday. The trials of the new missile of the BAL Coastal Defense Missile System confirmed that its flight range exceeded 500 kilometers, and its new guidance system also allows it to strike targets on the ground, the source said. The BAL system deploys the KH-35 and KH-35U missiles with a firing range of 120 kilometers and 260 kilometers. An upgraded KH-35E missile ranges up to 300 km and can be targeted by a drone. BAL is a low-altitude missile defense system and can launch 32 rockets in a salvo with another 32 missiles in stock. The BAL's new capabilities in terms of its firing range and the capability to strike ground targets make it comparable to the Bastion Coastal Defense Missile System that uses the Onyx supersonic missile, both the system and the missile have been developed by the Research and Production Association of Machine Building, the source specified. The Tactical Missiles Corporation that is developed and produces the BAL Coastal Defense Missile System declined to comment to TASS on this information. The Bastions are equipped with Onyx supersonic anti-ship missiles capable of hitting targets at ranges of up to 600 kilometers. The complexes can receive target designation from aircraft and helicopters, surface and submarine ships, with which they are combined into a standard circuit. These missiles can now target surface targets too, as per the designer NPO Mashinostroenia. In fact, the Russian, Indian BrahMos missile originally was the design of 3M55 Onyx, SSN26 Strabal, ramjet-powered anti-ship missile. BrahMos has been modified for several other roles. As per the Russians, the missile is operated by Vietnam, Syria, and Indonesia too. In 2019, the Russian Military Industrial Corporation NPO Mashinostroenia developed an improved version of the missile, the Onyx M, capable of striking sea and ground targets at a distance of up to 800 kilometers. In addition, the protection of the rocket from electronic warfare was enhanced. According to reports, the Russian army deploys the BAL and the Bastion Coast coastal defense launchers for combat operations in Syria to strike ground targets. Recently Russia used its newest frigate of Project 22350 to destroy targets in the Arctic during a drill. This was done to simulate target destruction if a frigate runs out of its missiles. A single frigate and the Balor Bastion batteries can destroy a fleet, including the aircraft carriers. A Bastion division consists of eight anti-ship missiles and the DBK launchers can be quickly reloaded and dispatched. This year, the Ministry of Defense held a series of exercises in the Crimea and the Baltic, where the combination of bastion and ball systems operated with drones. Targeting can be provided through aeroplanes and helicopters too. A Russian BAL coastal defense missile system was designed as a successor to aging Soviet Redut, Western reporting name SSC-1 or Sepal, and Ruba's coastal defense missile systems. It was adopted by a Russian military in 2004. Its Western reporting name is SSC-6 or Sennite. This system is also being proposed for export customers. The BAL coastal defense system uses KH-35 anti-ship cruise missiles. The launcher vehicle is based on an MZKT-7930 heavy high-mobility chassis with 8x8 configuration and carries eight cylindrical containers with KH-35 anti-ship cruise missiles. The KH-35 is a sea-skimming missile. It is also referred as 3M24. It has broadly similar performance to that of the French Exocet and Franco-Italian Automat anti-ship missiles. 
In terms of range and destructive power the KH-35 slightly looses to a US Harpoon missile. It carries a 145 kg high explosive fragmentation, he frag, warhead. It was designed to pierce horizontally through the bulkheads and compartments prior to exploding inside the ship. This missile was designed to defeat vessels with a displacement of up to 5,000 t. So it should be efficient against frigates and smaller destroyers. The KH-35 has inertial navigation system with active radar homing on the terminal stage of its flight. This missile travels 10 to 15 meters above the surface at subsonic speed. In the terminal stage of the flight the missile descends to 3 to 5 meters above the surface in order to overcome hostile defense systems. This missile travels at subsonic speed of 950 10 10 kilometers per hour. However it is estimated that due to its subsonic speed this anti-ship missile can be intercepted rather easily, especially by advanced naval defense system. Initially the BAL coastal defense system was offered with a baseline KH-35 missile that had a maximum range of 130 kilometers. Its active radar seeker had a range of 20 kilometers. However in around 2015 the Russian military adopted an improved KH-35U missile, which is a current production version. It is fitted with more powerful engines and carries more fuel. As a result it has range of up to 260 kilometers. That's twice the range of the baseline KH-35. The KH-35U also has improved guidance systems with satellite navigation update and a more sensitive seeker with a lock-on range of 50 km. The KH-35 is efficient out to a sea state 6. It is a relatively inexpensive weapon that costs around $500,000 per missile. Russian military also operates a similar Bastion P coastal defense missile system, which was adopted in 2010. It carries more capable P-800 Onyx missiles, but only two missiles per launcher vehicle. The BAL coastal defense system launches its missiles at a fixed angle. Missiles can be launched with short intervals of several seconds between the launches. Also missiles can be launched up to 10 kilometers from the sea, 